Hi there, I'm Jamie Keat and welcome to my video on using Google Drive today. Uh, we're going to be taking a look at in this video creating and adding files to your Google Drive. Uh, may take a look at the top right hand uh, corner and use my cards to jump to other videos um, about the same topic of Google Drive. If you like what you see, please subscribe to my channel so you get notified when my new videos come out. So I'm already logged into my account right now. You can see by my profile picture up in the top right hand corner and I just need to get to my Google Drive. So I'm just going to click on my nine little squares up here that show my apps and I'm going to select Google Drive. So when I uh, come over to my Google Drive, you can see um, I have some things already in it um, that I kept uh, saved here. Um, I'm just going to jump in right away and show you how to create uh, new folders and files uh, in it. So there's a few different ways you can create new files. Uh, we can hit our new button over here. Uh, you can see we have our Google Docs and Sheets and Slides or even more if we go through and I can connect to more apps just like at the web store. Um, but I can also select up here. Um, I get out the same different uh, menu type and if I right click I also get it too. So I tend probably to use the right click a little bit more than anything else but it doesn't really matter uh, which way, whatever way works uh, best for you. So um, right now I can you can uh, see I'm in my main part. Uh, I have uh, what's highlighted over here. You can see all my um, folders uh, come up here and I can navigate uh, through my different folders and jump through uh, different ones like that. Or I can actually uh, use my breadcrumbs up here to jump back uh, to different folders. So there's a few different ways you can navigate around uh, your Google Drive. So if I go and create a uh, full, or sorry, a file in here right now, I'm just gonna create a Google Doc here and just open it up here. And I'm just gonna call this, uh, I'll just call this test. And you can see it's saving up. It shouldn't take very long and there it's saved and if I exit out I have this brand new file here called test. Um, it was created in this part of my Google Drive because that's where I was located when I created it. So um, let's make a and same thing if I make a uh, folder so you just go and hit the top one where it says the plus folder and I'll just call this um, I'll just call this uh, example here and I'll hit create and then you see the example folder that gets created in here. Um, so if I go into my example folder and create a document in there, uh, you'll see, I'll just call this test two here. And I'll exit out of here once I see it saved and then uh, it should pop open. There it is inside um, my example folder. So just remember when you're creating, uh, if you want to, uh, so you don't have to move it later, uh, just go to the folder where you want it to be created um, and then, um, then it will appear there. So I'm just gonna go back to uh, my drive here again. So we've created our folder and we've created a um, example of a file. Remember we have our different types of files that we can create in the same, um, it's same thing applies, make sure you're in the, in the folder where you want it to, to, uh, to be created. Uh, so the other thing to get folders and files up here are to um, upload them from your computer. And to do that, we just go to uh, new and you can see I have file upload here or I have folder upload. So if I was picking a file, I'm just going to go, it opens up, I'm going to grab something from my desktop here and I'm just going to grab this image five here. It's a JPEG. Uh, but it wouldn't matter what type of file it is. I would just grab it and you can see um, that uh, it gets uploaded here uh, to my Google Drive. Now, if you had a lot of things uh, to upload, I probably wouldn't want to grab the one at a time like that. Uh, what you could do is have them in a folder. And I'm going to guess if you're kind of switching over from a kind of a network position uh, and using more cloud base, uh, there's a lot of files you have uh, to copy over. And then so what you can do is go to your uh, folder upload and you can just grab, uh, for instance, I'll just grab this YouTube one that's about three megs, I think, and hit upload. And uh, you can see it quickly gets uh, upload here by my head. And um, it should appear, it's a little hung up. And uh, oh, there it is right up top here. You can see um, that it's up there and if I open it up, uh, the files and different things are in it uh, there. So that's how I could upload a uh, file and folder from my uh, from my desk. So the other thing I can do, which I tend to use probably the most, is um, I use the drag and drop feature. So um, let me just move a couple things out of the way here. So with the drag and drop, say I have these report cards here. Um, what I'm gonna do is just drag across 
and it's the same thing same thing as kind of a file um, you know what we did before with the new file upload but I just find it a little quicker to uh, drag and drop things across and again I could put it into any of these folders so those are just some basic tips about creating new folders and files and how to get some some of your old stuff into your Google Drive to start with so remember um, if you like what you see please subscribe to my video and use the cards to uh, jump to the next video that I have ready for you